Hey everybody, it's Ravi from Detroit Driver and I'm here today outside of Cauley Ferrari. Today is something very special. They are having a one day premiere of the Ferrari Roma here in Detroit. So we're gonna go check it out. They also have the Ferrari SP2 Monza, which I'm so excited to see up front and in person. So let's do it. We have the new F8 Tributo here. This replaced the 488. Look at that interior. Not a huge fan of white cars, but this spec is amazing. They brought back the two taillights, kind of like the 812 Superfast. Look at this. They even have the air vents back there. And then they carried over the air bend in the front from the 488 Pista. So this car looks incredible. So now we're at the Monza SP2. This is a very limited production. Only 499 of these will be made. The SP1s and the SP2 Monza. Roughly $2 million. This is Ferrari's Speedster that they come out with. A lot of other companies have started to do this. Um, some companies in the past have done it as well. It's based off the A12 Superfast and it's part of Ferrari's Icona series which is a new series that they're lining up which basically is a modern interpretation of some of their historic models some cool things to point out these wheels are huge 21 inches they look great this decal is hand painted it's 50 percent larger than the normal scuderia shields some speedsters don't have doors like the mclaren alva but this one does and they do open up butterfly style which is cool one thing I really like about the back is the taillight you can see the taillight starts from here and goes all the way around back up to here it reminds me a lot of the P1 not the same shape but the idea these humps are so cool this one's in different color originally I thought this was black it's actually a very dark metallic blue which matches the blue stripe that we see up here. Super awesome. Carbon fiber everywhere. Something I really like is this center mirror. Obviously, no roof, so you couldn't mount the mirror on the top. The steering wheel looks pretty much like Ferrari steering wheels. And then you have the center console, which looks kind of plasticky, unfortunately, for a $2 million car, maybe a little more, but everything else is carbon fiber. Look through the middle there see that the seats are nice and thin and then you have the Monza SP2 limited edition you kind of have a, a glass that's stationary there to help with wind and then you have this little dinky attempt at a windshield for the passenger not really much but it probably does a lot for the aerodynamics of the car and wind 
Obviously no floor carpets in here, fire extinguisher, some air vents. Definitely would want to wear a helmet when you drive this, but I think it looks absolutely awesome. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Look at the grill got here. I love the styling. It's very different from Ferrari. Again, kind of a modern interpretation of their heritage cars. But look at this thing. And just look at this place. Kali Ferrari is awesome. Huge special thanks to them for opening up for the public today. Very, 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 very thankful for this opportunity. Huge special thanks to Kali Ferrari. Um, they opened their showroom to the public today so we could view those very special cars. Everybody was super friendly and I got a lot of cool video. So big thanks to them. Can't wait to someday get a car from here. Hopefully in the not so distant future. So thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what you thought. We saw some very, very special cars. So can't wait to see you next video.